Tree Veneration Society aims to recontextualize the historical practice of the sacredness and veneration of trees across nearly all cultures into a progressive contemporary community art project. While being environmentally conscious of the value of trees, particularly in our environmentally challenged world, they also hope to bring some sense of the ritual created in forming a cross-cultural celebration of nature. The booby wrap. The, the booby wrap tree, as you can see, has lots of beautiful boobies. And really what it is doing is calling you to see the nurturing, the nurturing of the tree through us who, as humans, nurture our children. I'm Amanda Farquharson, and my piece is Found Ground Lost Terrain, or the future, coming ready or not, and going nowhere fast. I work intuitively, uh, things I find, trash, treasure on the street, and I recycle things and make things out of something that looks like rubbish. I turn it into something. It's really My name's Louise Fowler-Smith. I'm the founder of the Tree Veneration Society and this is the Hugging Tree. Well, like all the other aspects of the Tree Veneration Society, it's the aim is to get people to think differently about the tree, how they perceive the tree, their relationship with the tree, or really the relationship with the natural environment. Research has found that the practice of venerating the tree through decoration protects the trees in countries such as India. This has led the Tree Veneration Society to question whether it is possible for the artist to inspire a re-envisioning of the environment through the aesthetic and whether sacredness can be transferred through artistic vision without transplanting any specific religious ideology.